two one blood. Budding Isaac Rebirth just dropped today, dropped all over. Um, it let me import my data, so I'm gonna do that. I'm gonna see if I can convince it to. Uh, can it? Can I not resize it? Is it just full screen or? You I, should be able to stretch out the window. Oh, can you just stretch out the window? Okay. Yeah, like the maximize button that doesn't work, but you can stretch it. Hmm. It doesn't seem to lock to ratios though. Nope. That seems like a problem. I just remembered this was coded by Nicholas, aka kind of the worst. <laughs> oh fuck. Alright, well let me just turn full screen on and off. Oh really? And it doesn't reset itself to a proper size? Oh. That could be a problem. Okay, there we go. No, it reset itself to a non-proper size again already. God, how does Nicholas keep getting work? Isaac and his mother <laughs> alone in a small house on a hill. Isaac kept to himself. Uh, drawing... All right, well I'll try full screen here. See if that fixes it. No, somehow. Okay, there. I think I think that fixed it. I don't know. We'll see. It looks like it did. Also, oh good, there's a new difficulty, and it's greed, which I'm sure it's good. Well, greed isn't a difficulty. It's kind of a different game mode. Hmm. Oh, and there's one new character that you have to use. Zazzle. But let's uh, just go ahead and start normal style. Um, I don't know who's normal style anyway. Start with the lost, yeah. Yeah, start with the lost. That's the good <laughs> shit. Ah, good. It has set itself up pointing in correct directions. Which gross child named after a Bible character are you? Oh, can I not change that here? Really? <laughs> Nicholas, now I can't even use my keyboard. Are you for real? Wait, really? Yeah, it just for some reason disconnected that. Oh, Jesus Christ. Yeah, the problem is it um, set up the directions wrong for my controller. Because I'm using like a, um, there we go. Um, it's A, B, X, Y inverted from an Xbox 360 controller. Oh. Yeah. So it defaults the wrong direction. And it doesn't accept the input. Oh, well, well, we're playing again. I just forgot I had to change all that stuff the first time I played, so it wasn't like a new thing. So... This mostly just added, I know Smite was losing his mind over it, but what all did this actually add? There's a bunch of new enemies, new items, new bosses, new room types. Okay. Basically just a big old expansion pack. Oh man, were those double direction guys there, or the eight direction, like the guys who were the meats plus the goops? Yep. There's new enemy, the enemy variants for existing ones and brand new types as well. Some of them are kind of dicks. Yeah, that one is already kind of a pain in my ass. An eight direction shot in floor one. Okay, a little rude. God, this is a rude fucking room, dude. <laughs> this is a rude ass room. Got him, okay. Played this a little bit earlier today. I hadn't played the normal mode yet. I played greed mode to kind of get used to the new stuff for a bit. Does it mostly show the new stuff in greed mode? No, no, it's just like a, it's kind of a shorter 
Uh, Gates. Like a rush mode, kind of? Yeah, sort, sort of something like that. That's good that they added an entire, like, new mode. Yeah, it's pretty fun. It's yeah. a lot more oriented towards combat. Nice. I mean, so you spend a lot less time walking around a level. Mm -hmm. I'll say the good thing for me is I still don't really know everything backwards and forwards in um, just Rebirth already. What the fuck room is this? These are, this is a new room type. This narrow. I don't know if it is good or not. Oh, hey, and an item sack. Yeah, there's already new... New equipment and what, or new, like a new sack, I guess. I guess that's just their way of dropping a chest without you needing a key for it. or so, well, But that's regular chests. Oh. Huh. Do they drop more than one item, though? Unless they're, like, I know gold ones can drop more than one. I don't remember if regular ones can. What, chests? I thought, yeah. they, I thought they could. Like a couple things. Mm. I don't know. I wonder what the difference between sacks those are. Well, give it a week, and people have figured everything out and data yeah, mined it. Data mined it, yeah. <laughs> a week? Man, that's... You're really, like, betting hard into these guys. Uh... How long did it take for the Lost? Um... I think it took longer because it was actually really complicated to data mine that, because it didn't really make sense. <laughs> As opposed to... A lot of the other stuff, which was, like, I just kind of... I don't know, nope. they'll start data mining it immediately, is kind of what I'm getting yeah. at. Also, Super Meat Boy Super Fan, I'm not going to re-roll that. That's just a really good item. <laughs> yep. I'm not going to do better than all stats up. I don't think. Especially with the Duke of Flies, who is... Not terribly tanky, but a little bit. Mostly because the whole shot blocking thing. Yeah, like if you have no damage ups or you have a character with low damage when you get to this boss. Especially on the first floor, it kind of sucks. Now, I don't remember which... Is this a new item? I don't remember this one. Not from the uh, boss room. The blue mushroom? Blue mushroom... Maybe... Well, I think... Yeah, I think those control for gotcha. Well, but I can reroll stuff if that's like not a true thing. Just touch it. The mushrooms are usually stat ups, and I'm pretty sure that is from the old one. It's not okay. A new item. HP up, tears down, yeah, all that. Also, Loon, I'm not gonna just touch it every time because I do actually like want to try and force new items more. And also, no, Super Meat Boy fan is uh, literally just all stats go up. It's ridiculously good. This game also has a built-in item tracker. Oh, it does actually now. Yep. I don't have to run a separate program to do that. The only problem is it doesn't actually tell you what the items just do still. Oh, you just okay. can't see the icon, so it just saves you a little bit of time. Oh. Hello, the soul. <laughs> well. No. Oh. What's the other thing the soul does? It gives you hearts and then doesn't it like lightly push things away from you? I don't remember. I know it's one of the godhead items. The mind just reveals the map at all times. I actually rarely get these, so I don't remember what they do. All the Godhead items are just like ridiculously good and in general. Yeah, they might add, they probably added a new cutscene. Um, the other thing they've added, I know for sure, is some alternate tracks for some different places, and I want to hit the alternate tracks because they're pretty good. Um, also, I want to figure out what some of the new music tracks they're adding in are for, because I'm sure they've added in a boss. They always do with these expansions. Uh, when I played through Greed Mode, as far as I could tell, it was all new music, like I'd never heard it before. Oh, it so. might just all be Greed Mode then, where the new music is? Like, I, I haven't played through Normal, so it might show up in Variants maybe, but... I have, uh... That's where I've seen most of the new stuff. Also, yeah, a new room. That makes that fight a lot more interesting, and a lot less running around in circles, doing a little dance with him.
Here's to hoping I crash the game within like 20 minutes. <laughs> I, I think, I don't know exactly how fast it was, but Smite crashed the game pretty Smite quickly. Smite managed to, yeah, ruin it the it was like second run started. One. Yeah, I think it was like run one, he got something that was so busted, it just, the game crashed all over. Yeah. Okay, yeah, the soul pushes bullets away lightly. Yep. Including the an including pin. Apparently, pin counts as one giant bullet. <laughs> Oops, I keep forgetting I have the D6. Um, oh man, books are always basically bad, right? Like, I don't really want any of these. Uh, some of the books are really good. That one's just the damage boost book, and then the other one is the really bad one, if I remember right. It just like does a random thing. Or gives you a random item, I think. Yeah, it's not the Dead Sea Scrolls. It's the one that gives you a random item. Um, Why would I, I grab both books? I could only use one of them, and I would lose two of my... That what? Yeah, the D6 is only to reroll items already on the ground. So you would pick them up, and then you would lose them. Why, why wouldn't you just reroll them beforehand? Does that make any sense? Yeah... I'll just d6 it. Um, now to remember which key is which. Okay, there we go. Um, God, is that... I can never remember the Devil Room items because they're all so wonky. I can't remember if that's Whore of Babylon or not. And then that little brother is the really bad one, I think. Uh, just wait for the stream to catch up. Mm -hmm. Okay, so the one on the right is just kind of a... Extra damage familiar. And the one on the left is Horror of Babylon, so. Okay, Horror of Babylon is terrible. <laughs> well, now I have a chance for Angel Rooms. Shit. <laughs> That's the worst part. Hmm. Who knows, maybe there are new Angel Room items that are quite good. Also, the only thing that sucks is my favorite music of the new ones I listen to is the alternate track for the caves. Um, mm. And the reason that sucks is because the caves already had, in my opinion, the best music in the game. So, <laughs> just replacing the best music with more of the best music. I can't remember <laughs> if little, little Dark Bum is... You know what? Yeah, I'm going to use him anyway. I'm pretty sure they nerfed him, but I'm sure he's still good enough. Uh, I haven't gotten him in Rebirth, or Afterbirth, but he's still really good. Mm-hmm. Like, I know they, they nerfed him, but it's... Like, you will still get multiple soul hearts on each floor. It's so good. Well, these are extra fast turds. <clears throat> Expedient turds. Good. Thanks, Binding Isaac. I need to find the new memes. I've heard they're here. <laughs> I can't talk to Future Friend until I found at least one hot new meme. <laughs> then... Then we can speak again. Oh, good. Good! I love troll bombs. They're great. Still uh, good. Classic memes. There. Uh, at least I got a meme. Yeah, these new room layouts have all been pretty good. They've been pretty simple, but at the same time, that's not, like, really a bad thing. That's not like, yeah. oh, these layouts are easy to deal with and make sense. It's like, oh, okay, that's fine. <laughs> oh, wow, these guys are new, and they, wow, this is a pain in the ass. Holy shit. Wow, and those little guys pop into bullets, huh? Jeez. Jibbity Christmas. Oh, gosh. There are a couple of new variations that explode the spiders as well that kind of suck. Holy shit, these guys blow. Wowee, these guys are going to take a while to learn to deal with. Oh my god. So it's because they blow up into diagonal bullets? Holy cow, those guys are trash. Bill. Health down, nice. Have enough money to 
make it worth my time to go into the market yet, so. Uh. This is a new track, I think. I don't know, I haven't memorized the original Binding of Isaac OST. <laughs> Oh, this guy. Is this guy new? Yep. I feel like this guy's new because I would have remembered these actually kind of fun patterns. Yeah, this guy definitely new. Oops. I accidentally picked up dinner instead of re-rolling it. That was actually a really good fight. <laughs> that was actually prop that was great. And that music was pretty good too. Also, hell yeah, this is the new music track for the for the alt caves. Oh, flooded caves, I haven't seen this. Mm-hmm. So I saw Smite doing the XXXXXL challenge, and that oh. had like burning basement. What? <laughs> burning ba I'm sorry? <laughs> Yeah, burning basement. Did it change from shining basement first, at least? Or like, what? <laughs> <laughs> What's going on here? Burning basement. Like, I don't know if they change anything or it's just a graphical... Oh my god, is this another mushroom? Is this mushroom percent run? Like, what the hell? <laughs> Get all them mushies. Hmm. I'm considering just not re-rolling and going for a mushroom percent. I don't know what it does, but... I don't know what's new and not. Oh well. Just the damage uh, I, up mushroom. Yeah, I know that one definitely is uh it's an existing item, but it's not bad. It's health up, damage up, range up, but you get speed down. No, that, the bit. one I just picked up was just flat damage up. Oh yeah, no, it it says damage up, but it also changes other stats. Oh, okay. It's just, you know how Isaac does it where it doesn't actually tell you half the stuff your item does. Yeah, yeah. My range is really good. My yeah, okay, yeah. Yeah, I always forget Binding of Isaac, aka Binding of... W w you thought we'd tell you how things worked? What? <laughs> what? I'm just hoping for an angel room on this floor. Alright, let's take another pill. Let's roll them bones. I found pills. Also, there's a narrator now. When you take pills. Yeah. What's up? Smite was saying he wanted a Psych Eyeball narrator mod. Yeah. Someone get me Domon Kashu's voice actor. <laughs> I have work for him. Oh, what are these chubby bats? Oh shit, I love these guys. I don't even know what they do. I love them. They're so fat. I love them. They've got like little bat double chins. Oh shit, these guys rule! They're animated to look like they're trying so damn hard just to float there. Mm -hmm. Really, Dark Beggar? You just threw... Alright, man. <laughs> That's how you want to play this. Yep, sometimes people throw spiders. So, you might like this, Ty. I looked up the voice actor did Domon Kashu. Uh-huh. He's not doing voice acting anymore. Oh. He's an orthopedic surgery resident. Bullshit! <laughs> Domon Kashu has become... I might work with Domon Kashu! <laughs> you guys could talk shop! Oh my god, I might have done work with... Um, for all I know, I've worked with Domon Kashu! Oh, holy well, shit! Well, he, wor he works in, in St. John's, Newfoundland, so... No, I work internationally. Like, I've, I worked with, like, 30-something countries, I think. Oh, so, like you may have spoken with them in the past. Yeah, <laughs> like via email or something. Like, damn, I may have planned surgeries for Domon Kashu. That's the best news. Not, 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 not me, John, will you, like, give your hopes up here, but I do have a relative who is a pharmacist in Newfoundland. <laughs> <laughs> I've got calls to make. <laughs> Does the name Mark Gatha ring a bell? We'll talk later. I'll figure it <laughs> out. Oh, hello, Scythes, which from what I understand are always good. Hello, Guppy Tail for free. 
Um, so scythes are ridiculous, right? Yep, scythes are all good. Uh, razor blade kind of sucks, I think. It's it's mostly for Eve, yeah. Yeah, so reroll on that and get missing page two, which I actually don't know what that is. Wait, someone lives by St. John's in Newfoundland? What? <laughs> you might be able to get knee surgery from Domo! <laughs> Wow, okay, these seem this seems pretty good. This loadout seems pretty okay, Andy. Andy, I feel like we're gonna be doing okay here. This is a pretty good loadout you got going on. What the fuck is Mystery Page 2? Is that a new thing or is that because I, I don't remember two. I know missing page. Missing page two is is from the first one, yeah. Um that is one black heart. Uh and if you take damage if the total sum of Isaac's red hearts and soul hearts is under one and a half hearts, the Necronomicon effect will activate. Okay. So there's just like, it was like a final chance I'll live through. No. Like, it just does at a, a retaliation attack. No, that's, get hit that's what I mean, run. is if I get like that low, it'll do a retaliation oh, yeah. and possibly like clear a room or something. Mm hmm. Hmm. Do I go for the gold? Well, okay, I have to take damage for that one, so never mind. Do you have any keys? I have one. Oh. And that's why I'm a little unsure. I do have 19 of gold, though, so you know what? I'm going to go for the shop. Black candle? The heck is a black candle? Black candle is immunity to curses. That doesn't sound very good. On account that I don't even know what curses do. Is it evil up? Like yeah, sure. Evil up. Let's do it. Let's be as evil as hell. Well, curses, like, you know when you start a floor and you have the curse of darkness and you can't see anything? Oh, it keeps those that's, from happening. What, yeah. That is considerably better than what I thought it would be. That's nice. At the very least, that's nice. I don't have to worry about, like, oops, XL floor where I can't see shit. Also, I get yeah. to look goofy, which is always the best bonus of all. Apparently, this also gives you a higher chance of the devil deal. Mm hmm Yeah, it said it was evil up. Oh, okay. Plus 20% to devil deal chance. That's good. Nice, nice, nice. Got another, another soul heart. Yeah, this is a pretty good setup. All right, where are you at, mom hand? Good night, mom hand. Yeah, the soul is kind of making this run considerably easier. I always forget how good the soul is. Basically, unless there is an enemy trying to run directly into me, I am safe. What the fuck? Oh, is this like a reroll machine if I do not have di- Oh, well, let's touch it. Oh, wow, it is. You can use money as a chance to reroll. Oh. Yep. That's neat. Big part of greed mode. That's really cool. I like that idea. That is innovative in all the ways I like. Ah, hello, Joker, for guaranteed devil room. Ah, uh, what is justice? Is justice just you get a bunch of shit? Justice. Yeah. Uh, you're talking about the card, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, yeah, yeah. And death is ridiculous damage, and Joker is a deal. So, while I work up my charge here or money because I do want to re-roll that my reflection because my reflection is awful <laughs> my reflection is the fucking worst talk about an item that gets you killed most of the time holy cow oh thank you 
little guy. Hmm. Yeah, death is just a... Oh, it's Necronomicon? I'm thinking of the devil. Okay, the devil is the one I'm thinking of. I'll just go ahead and do this first. Dangle! Oh man, is this a new super turd? Oh, I love these guys. Do you? <laughs> <laughs> well, I fought a boss that spawned these guys. It was really fun. That sounds like hell to me. <laughs> well, no, I sorry, I mean when he died. Oh, spawned okay. these guys. Spawned a ton of little dudes, though. Oh, can you not spawn devil rooms on these floors? Oh, yeah, I guess not, because there's no way I would be able to get to one. Weird, and I took no red heart damage and have all the evil up, so I'm pretty sure I would have gotten one. Well, I did just give one last floor. Uh, bandage. Whatever, I'm going to see if I can... Oh, crap. See if I can get a reroll. And then take... Devil deal item. I'll take that. Spider bite scythes. That seems good enough. Uh, pick up Joker card. And probably use the Joker. I mean, I might as well, right? I can't think of a better time to yeah, really use it. Once you hit, uh, what is it? The, uh, the womb? Hmm. That's when it just takes you to the warp down to the next level. Don't be a waste. Oh, hello, enemies in here. <laughs> uh, okay, so the book is the book. The cloak is, what, two bomb hearts and anything else? Uh, the robe is really... What is that? <coughs> Sorry. Um, I think that's a damage up as well on top okay. of the black hearts. And it might not be a bad time to pick up the book, just so I have some kind of usable, honestly. Uh, that's the Book of Belial. That's the damage up. That's yeah, that's that what I mean. starts with. So that might be worth picking up at this point. Because, like, I don't really have... ...too many usables, so... I'll go ahead and pick that up. I'll take it. And Super Bandage, which gave me one heart. Yeah, that skeleton key was quite late. <laughs> oh god, they sure do like enemies that spawn spiders, huh? Oh wow, this layout sucks. <laughs> oh, oh crap. Oh wow, this is not a good room for Lust to be in. Get out of here! Get out of here! <laughs> Scamp! Yeah, let's see if I can get a single positive pill. No. <laughs> no. No, I can't. No, this is the first actual full expansion, so it is not free. It was like... It was on sale for like... Six dollars and sixty six cents because of fucking course it was <laughs> for a while, a while. Man, just no keys, huh? <laughs> no keys, who needs them? Oh, I've heard blowing up skulls is pretty good. Yep, you they can draw cards and black hearts. Nice. Oh, and the Emperor is the skip right to the boss, isn't it? Mm -hmm. Um, Can I use that in like, uh, like cathedral or whatever? Any floor with a boss. It works you straight there. Wow, that sounds quite nice, actually. 
Now I have to be very careful to never hit the wrong button and use it. Yeah. <laughs> or else I'm gonna... What? Doesn't that blow up and make a bridge? Oh, I guess there was nothing there. There we go. I'm dumb. Oh, thank God. Give me those keys. Fucking about time. Um, having trouble getting Afterbirth to run. I've heard some people are having issues. I cannot personally comment on it, though. For me, it was just some controller wonkiness, but... Oh, wow, this room blows. Bikes and very sturdy invisible guys. Yeah, these ghosts take a lot of hints. Apparently this game is still $6.66 on the Humble Store, but they're out of keys. Oh. So does that mean you can buy it, but you then have to wait for them to get new keys in, I'm guessing? Yeah. One of those interesting things. Oh shit, D20, that's re-roll everything on the ground, right? Oh god, I don't... <laughs> so many different dice. Yeah. D20... If I, if I remember right, this is the one that's not super broken. D20 is all pickup consumables, so that's hearts, bombs, keys, coins, pills, tarot cards, chests, and trinkets. Mm -hmm. That sounds like the worst of them. Oops, accidentally used my book. Yep, you don't have your dice anymore. I can run around with it for a... Actually, I want to recharge my book. Damn it. Does D20 lead to a lot of brokenness? All right, I'll, I'll take your word for it. The store was probably not my best choice in retrospect. Oh, that's fine. I'm a little out of practice to say the least. Um, I need to buy a key while I'm here. And, oh. I mean, I guess I could buy a bomb. I can't remember what that pill is. I wish they would just tell you once you have taken it. D100 is the best one because that just rerolls your entire loadout. Oop. Whatever, no rules. Oh. Yep, rerolls everything you have and any pedestal and pickups in the room as well. Oh, I didn't know I got those too. Nice. God, scythes are so nice for being able to hit the backside of those jerks. Yeah, God, I can reroll collectibles in the chest. That's kind of nice. <clears throat> Oops. God, I'm just thinking about the first game where there were so many things you could do to make this fight end the game. Like, if you use any of the stop enemy items... God, yeah. ...versus Mom or Satan, it just made the game end. Like, congrats yep. on your game being done. That happened to me a number of times. I was not super uh, happy about it. I just got owned a hundred times in a row. Brutal. Which one is Gimp Suit? That's damage makes you sometimes get hearts or something? Gimp Suit is a random chance when you get hit. It either drops a soul or black heart. Good enough. Let's do it. Let's just overload on devil items. Why not? Let's just go ham.
Okay, so can I not hit this guy with these? Oh, that's right. I have to wait for him to pop out. Yeah, there we go. I forgot. It's that guy. Oh, hey. An actual trinket. Boy, that pulls enemies, too. Oh, crap. I wish I hadn't picked that up. Is that a new thing? I think it is. I think that's a new one. I do not remember the super magnet. Oh, God. It's some kind of hell trinket. Oh, yeah. <laughs> that, that's definitely not how Loki's supposed to act. Yeah, just pull everyone to me. This is great. I love this. You can drop it? How? Yeah, uh, I don't know what the button on controller is. But there is a button you can hold down to drop any trinkets or usable items you have. Oh! Look at that. There's rusted key. It feels lucky. Oh shit, this could be a good reroll room. I think I did that wrong, but I'll be damned if I didn't do it. The hanged man. Good. Give me give me these as well. <laughs> I also want those. Tears up. What I understand too is bad gas is actually quite good in fights. Uh, yeah, bad gas is pretty decent for damage, it's just you only get these at once. Mm -hmm. I'll just backtrack and get the Emperor after this. Oh, this is a pain. <clears throat> oh, wait, okay, my slides are slower than... There was probably a simpler solution. That my brain was refusing. Oh, hello, the left to... hand. <laughs> Should we get Guppy on top of everything else? <laughs> I mean, well, I you don't have any other Guppy items, though, do you? I have the tail. Oh. Though so it would not be unreasonable to get. Oh, that's the monkey paw. Never mind. That's not the left hand. It's monkey's paw and you got the one? Yeah, it was. Okay, yeah. Uh, half heart of life remaining, a black heart spawn. Okay. I just never get that, apparently. Mm hmm. Oh, hello, fate. All right, well, <laughs> okay. Now the build's looking pretty good. That I think that seals it. This build's doing pretty okay. No, left hand doesn't count as guppy. It turns all chests to red chests, if I remember correctly. Damn. Yup, just gonna go ahead and just fly wherever. Get triple keys. Yeah, whatever, sure. I think it's pretty safe to call this one a win, unless there's some super secret final boss that I'm not aware of. I don't even know why I'm getting so much shit right now, but whatever. <laughs> I'm getting a confusing <laughs> amount of shit. Oh my gosh, what am I holding on to that's giving me so many things? Well, you have the you have the rusty key that might do something. Oh yeah. Oh, is this a switch it? room? Oh man, Zelda puzzles. Oh wow. I mean, I guess the Empress is probably better for this fight than bad gas, and then I'll need to pick up the other one as well. Mm -hmm.
I don't think I've ever had to fight this boss. That might just be random chance. Yeah, this guy was definitely from the old one. Mm -hmm. I just also, haven't played Rebirth a ton. Yeah, he's also super easy if you've got flight. But, uh, is he? I don't. Even, I think he's supposed to be doing something else too, and just forgot. Like he'll normally shoot out <laughs> these. Uh, he'll normally shoot out blood pools oh, on the ground. Crap. Oh, okay, actually that worked out okay. I don't have much range. But my god, do I have damage! Holy shit, do I have damage! <laughs> or actually that might still be... No, okay, that's natural. Never mind, I have like a shitload of damage. Is that at the tower? I don't need that one. Light. They might as well just. Pheromones. Yeah, let me just re roll that into like 12 other of thing. Sure. There we go. There's my the Emperor. Monkey's Paw is like if you get reduced to half a heart, you, it spawns a black heart or something like that. Yep, but it only works three times. Mm -hmm. And if you happen to have something that would not be reduced to half a heart once you have hit the womb, it works zero times. Yep, doesn't save your life. Welcome to the wild world of the womb kind of makes a lot of things not work right. <laughs> the whole double damage thing kind of breaks a lot of shit in this game, unfortunately. Well, I have a ludicrous amount of damage, so let's go to the arcade. <laughs> I don't even know what I could possibly get other than, I guess, the poop on my head. I could get a doo-doo Proptosis. -doo what? Proptosis. What is that? Short range mega tears. Make your sides even bigger. Oh god. What is that from? Is that from the Gamble Beggar? Uh... No, can spawn in regular item rooms. Dang it, I was hoping to get Scutoli there. I think my luck is terrible. <laughs> Somehow. Well, yeah, if your stats got shuffled, it might happen. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I didn't even think about that. Wow, my luck might be the worst. I might have successfully zeroed my luck. Wow, what am I, zero for... <laughs> All of these? Well, these have pretty bad rates in general. Oh, wait, crud. I need to actually pick up the red hearts now. <laughs> oh, and I keep forgetting I can reshuffle stuff. Alright, well, now to celebrate my frustration. Hmm, I guess more gamble chances, and then we'll reroll everything else and try and get chests out of it. Just because I want the poo hat. Poo hat makes game so easy at a certain point. I think you're mostly past the point where it's super useful. Uh, except Blue Baby. Blue Baby makes it. Oh, yeah, true. Yeah, Blue Baby is its the best item in the game. Because <laughs> it's just, oh, what's that? 99% of your danger is just gone? All right. <laughs> Good night, sweet prince. Ah, child's heart. Actually, wait, that might be really good. Oh, well. Suicide King, that just makes you kill yourself. Right, good. 
Yep. Don't use that. <laughs> um. Hmm. Do I go with the sun or the emperor? Am I on floor two of the womb? I am, so I wouldn't be able to backtrack for stuff. Yep. All right. Well, then I'll just carry it around. No, not Suicide King. The Emperor. <laughs> careful. <laughs> careful, careful. Oh, is this the new alternate womb? The slightly grosser womb? Uh, I don't remember. Oh, oh yeah, this is definitely new. Right, I've never seen this before. I can fly. <laughs> right, <laughs> a flight, a thing I can do. Thank you, big boy. I will come back there to re-roll once I have charge, because I could get like 50 chests for all I know. Oh, this is the scarred womb, apparently. Hmm. So I guess these might just be graphical variants? Um, also I think they have like different, maybe, enemy types and stuff, like the basement does. Like the basement versus the, um... Uh, the cellar, and all that. <clears throat> Sorry. Oh, you're fine. Unfortunately, my, I'm, my bullets are quite slow, but my scythes can just form a hell ball. Which is okay, I suppose. Plus it slows stuff down when it gets hit. Yeah, so it kind of works out, I guess. Nothing can escape the wall of scythes. Yeah, these sides are pretty damn dangerous. <laughs> you just are kind of putting out just asinine amounts of damage at this point. Yeah, I would go as far as to say this damage is to the point that I really kind of don't have to worry about anything. Especially shit. Because <laughs> poop. <laughs> Do you get it? This game likes to make you play with duty. It's poop. It's mostly poop. poop. Poop, that's the part where the, it's the bum is the part where the poop comes up. Alright, are you ready to re-roll this shit way too much? Oh good, one turned into a troll bomb. Thanks, Obama. <laughs> Alright, well. Go get another charge and re-roll that again. <laughs> See if we can get not that. What pills were you? Pretty fly. Pheromones, which are okay. Oh, your bum's eating to your profits. I know, right? That's fine. He can go his own way. I'm part of the Fleetwood Mac school of this. <laughs> <laughs> the nice thing is if they are slowed down and their bullets are also slowed down. Oh good, a health down. Nice. And one more reroll on whatever bullcrap is left in that room. What do you got for me? Hey, a chest. With more doubloons. Whatever. Sure, doubloons. If I do need soul hearts <laughs> before I get to the boss, I'm set, baby. We're good. We're rolling in them. My damage might be a little much. It might be a tad excessive. <laughs> Yeah, they aren't permanent flies though, they're pretty flies, so I don't I think those go away right when they get hit. No, pretty flies permanent. Oh, is it? Mm-hmm. Oh. It's only the blue flies, those disappear. Well then I guess I'm in pretty good shape, huh? <laughs> yeah. Wait, what did I even get hit by? Oh, there was a turd! Fucking, <laughs> this is... This is why... You never do a lost run. Ever. Yep, red turds. 
literally the worst part of the fucking lost run <laughs> is you get to the end and oops you ran into a poop when you entered a room way to go smarty now your run's over oh that one shoots in both directions cool I guess I'll grab a soul heart just to be safe yeah I touched a red poo Oh, wait, whoops, this isn't the room I was going to. Well, no big deal, I suppose. No harm, no foul. That's jump, man, right? All that does is give me the ability to jump. Uh, it's the cartridge, right? Yeah, also, I just ran into another red poop. Fuck it, I don't care. I give up! <laughs> I hit the poop! Yeah, the poop sucks. I try and read the chat for a second and immediately run into another turd and so is life and so is me. <clears throat> oh good, another eye opened up on my butt. Oh my god, between the soul and the slowdown, I am almost more confused as far as what is happening. <laughs> In its own dumb way, it has almost made the patterns harder to deal with. Yeah, I was going to say, if you didn't have the soul, it'd be really difficult because they'd be stacking up on each other. Mm -hmm. Um... Oh, of course, I get a devil deal room here, but that just takes me down a floor, you know. Yep. Oh, it's Pac-Man randomly. Okay, it's not. Oh, man, that's a pretty good chance of guppy, guppy shit. One of them. I don't even know what- oh, this is the random chance to respawn is with health. It's got the item number two, I think. Yup, sure is. Sure, next part of the boss rush. Thank God I got rid of that super magnet, huh? <laughs> that would have been rough. Yeah. That, that could be a little difficult for you. <laughs> I mean, probably wouldn't have any issue even with it on, but still. Mm -hmm. I could bomb my way through Cathedral too, couldn't I? You could. Just bomb my way through Cathedral and then... Emperor my way through the chest. Yeah, that's what we'll attempt to do here for any boss related rooms. These guys are chumps. This room's just annoying. Oh, good. It still does the thing where it hits you before it actually... It's a hit scan. His stomp has fucking hit scan. God, I hate that. How could I have forgotten the joy of him hitting you before he's on screen? Yeah, I... I have never understood if it is indeed possible to dodge that or not. Nope, but. it's hit scan. Uh, and it'll just happen before he goes on screen. I, I don't know how they still have not fixed that shit. <laughs> yeah. Edmund, fix game. No. It's already making too much money. Why would I fix it? Mm -hmm. Oh, cut. I'm doing poorly. Yeah, fuck this other fork in the road. I'm just sunning this room. 
Well, the sun will show you where the boss is, yeah. Oh, yeah, that's right. Duh! I'm an idiot. Well, I'm on the right way. I'm on the right track, at least, so... I just have to now... Double back through this room again. Yeah, let's just kill this. Because I need you before we go on. Got all these tarot cards. Can you backtrack out of uh, Isaac's room? Uh, yes. Okay, so I can go in with the Empress, use it, come back out, and grab the Emperor. Alright. That is the plan, then. Empress would actually be really good on Isaac. Yup! Just did shitload of damage. Because he doesn't move. Mm-hmm. Should be able to just unload on him very quickly. Oh man, I wish I had a battery charge. <laughs> That'd be a hell of a reroll room. Wowie. Wait, did Empress not go off? No, it did. Apparently. Huh. It claims it did. I don't know, it doesn't I... seem to be doing much more damage. It's supposed, it's supposed to do the stomp, isn't it? No, 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 the Empress is uh, Free Horror Babylon. Oh, I'm thinking of High Priestess. Yeah, no, Empress won't do anything, if, it, if that's the case. It'll increase my damage for this boss fight. Just good. It will let me kill him faster. Oh right, right. It gives you the effect. Okay, yeah, I thought it, it was. No, no, no. Like okay. it just immediately that included turns the health you... conditional. That'd be dumb. No, no, no. It just turns you into that mode. Okay. Yeah. <clears throat> oh, good gravy! Just be dead already. Die for me, Isaac. Thank you. All right. I'm gonna go get my stuff. All right, the Emperor. God, I almost want to do enough rooms to get a charge, but I'm not going to. Oh, that'd be so good. Oh no, did I switch out the? Po oh, that's right. The Polaroid isn't a holding item anymore. Yep, just a uh, collectible. All right, chess time. Kamikaze remote control poop and the what is this shit? <laughs> Look at this. Okay, so three out of those four were terrible. <laughs> Wait to see what the last one is. They're all terrible. Spoilers. They're all the worst. Oh my god. This is the single worst chest I have ever seen. Oh my god. <laughs> Yeah, I have the reusable airstrike, I guess. Yeah, bring bring the poop. Bring the poop to the final boss. That'll be good. <laughs> wow, that is incredibly bad. I guess I can... How does the remote control airstrike work with a controller? Uh, you just aim the reticle around with your regular aiming buttons and firing buttons, I think. Wow, like that it, was some, it just paints it's, it's really not great. That was some saucy ass fucking RNG. Holy shit. Alright, well hopefully we can get through this, because that was horseshit. Even without a good item here, you're more than enough to kill him. Oh, it I thought it was already fired. Never mind. Oh well, well that went well. Devil Beggar, please help. Do something. Dark Bomb. 
Come on, little buddy. Been handing you blue hearts this whole game. He just threw a spider at you that one time. <laughs> yeah, actually, he's been doing pretty good. God, this boss is so much easier than Isaac. <laughs> I don't. It always seems easier though. It's not just like a one-time thing either. I think the big thing is that you can counter his stuff with skill, whereas Isaac is just like, oh, he shot a beam at you that you couldn't dodge. Mm -hmm. Oh. <laughs> I was wondering why I hadn't hit the ending. I was like, uh, hello? Also, was there a big key door in the chest before? Yeah, that's how you fight the, uh, that's how you fight Mega Satan. Oh, I thought that was in the dark room. I think you can fight him in either one. Oh, okay. Alright, well, it was run one. I got, like, no new items. <laughs> yeah, that's actually really weird. I found a bunch. My first run. Well, there's new... New challenges. Let's play one. Oh, God. What? No shots? Ten bombs? Hmm. I don't know what those other markings are, but... Probably immune to flame? No. What is this? Oh, God. What is this garbage? Kamikaze bombs. That's all you get. Good, and regenerating enemies. And you get blue hearts, and that's it. Oh, no. What is this asshole challenge? How the fuck do you do this? Well, you're kamikaze. That's infinite use, but it costs a heart. And Maybe you things have blue hearts. Yeah, I'm wondering. There's got to be something else going on here. I mean, my bombs are really explosive. Yeah. And I'm immune to well, my apparently bombs, you're... Hmm? I guess. Just not fi fire. Well, okay. If that if that counts for the kamikaze, then you have infinite explosions. Oh! Okay, that's does. why. Okay. So I thought, oh, for, you don't have the item tracker on, that's right. Okay. That makes this considerably fucking easier. Yeah. Okay, wow, well, yeah. Uh, Knight was apparently saying this game can become unwinnable if there are no bombable enemies. If there's what? Like if you run into enemies that cannot be killed via bombs. Is that a thing? I don't know. Yeah, I don't know. I couldn't, I couldn't think of any. Oh, Satan is immune to kamikaze. Oh. Really? That's weird. I guess he's immune to kamikaze, but not regular bombs, I guess? Yeah, but still, if you don't have enough bombs at that point, what yeah. do you do? That seems kind of weird. You missed lethal, Edmund. I almost want to start my uh, legit save file back up and see like if there's like unlock conditions for the new stuff or is the new stuff just all piled on immediately? Uh, new stuff just got dumped at the pile. Like okay. When I loaded my file I found a bunch of new stuff as well. Okay, because in the original game, Wrath of the Lamb, of course they added like new areas to play through and shit. Mm-hmm. No, was... this, this stuff has its own unlock conditions. Oh, it does? Yeah. Like, there's a bunch of stuff for Lilith, for example. Um, there's other conditions like clearing greed mode and stuff. Ah, uh, okay. So even though I have real Platinum God, I don't actually get everything. That's probably going to be another super ultimate Platinum real Neo God. Mm -hmm. Wow, this room's pretty sick. I don't know what most of these items are. Ooh, Black Market. Yeah, black. I've never seen one of these. 
They're pretty rare. Um, what do I... Um, I don't know if it's even good anymore. PHC makes all pills good. I don't know what that middle thing is. I don't know what the piggy thing is. And I don't know what this crying boy is. Give me that. Sackhead. More thing on the left is brand new. More sacks. More sacks. Now I have a paper bag on my head. Hmm. As well as... Oh, maybe you get more of those, the treasure bags. Yep. Maybe that's what it does. Call me the sack man. That's kind of binding of Isaac Dog text. I don't know what this crying boy is. Yeah, what is this crying thing, dude? This tearful boy. The only downside to Kamikaze is it's not huge. Hmm. Good! I got Shoop to Whoop! Good. Ah, meme. I, I got a meme! Meme. Merm. And both of these cards I've picked up are the worst for me. Because <laughs> I, can't, I can't shoot, and I also can't do the other thing. Oh, whoops. Rip. Alright, let's... Let's try some of the other ones, because that seems like a better w so XXXXL I'm guessing that's just all areas or XL areas or something uh I think I don't think about it. it might even just be like one really big floor let's try the guardian what the fuck is this ah! <laughs> oh this is the whole, I have some kind of, I'm invincible, but I have one of those separate heart things, I think? Oh, yeah, you got your, uh, the heart is separate, so that's what your hitbox is now. And he's following around another. Oh, that's really weird. Oh, because you have to guard him, I see. What the fuck is this game mode? Also, this is actually really good for twin sticks, because it points yep. exactly where you point. Oh, this is weird as hell. This is, like, actually an entirely new way to play. Am I immune? Oh, wow, I'm invincible then. Okay. Yeah, like you just have to guard your little buddy there because he takes all the damage, not you. Yeah, this is actually that... kind of a cool game mode. I wonder what that sword is. Some kind of... Sword? <laughs> it's just like the knife with better range, but you can't throw it. I guess. Fortunately, I don't have any money. This is going to make boss fights really nightmarish, though. Yeah. Unless you can block bullets with your sword as well. Oh, good. Maybe not so much that. Like, if it jumps on your buddy, what can you really do? Oh, what is this guy? This boss fight's cool as shit. Little horn. I remember this guy. Okay, so that was an old guy, or that's a new... That looks like a new guy. No, no, he, he is new. I just... I felt, oh, I felt okay. I like him. Oh, waggle, 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 waggle. Waggle, waggle. Alright, so yeah, this is probably my favorite of the new modes. This, I mean, of the two I have played. I find this one to be quite good. Also, I can just run into those rooms and not take damage. Nice. Oh, fuck! Uh, there's some like that that I don't know what you're supposed to do. <laughs> like troll bombs and shit. You can kind of shove stuff away with your body, but the big troll bombs move really fast, so... Yeah. And unfortunately, it appears Dumb Dumb loves running at him. Because he thinks they're pickups. <clears throat> well, I have four of coin. Um, here, let's get some more health for stupid. Also, yeah, new transitions. Neat. 
Yeah, I'm wondering now if you can get the sword. No, I don't see why not. They? Okay, so yeah, you have the Holy Grail, sword, and then your body is split. Why are you? No! Damn it! Damn it, crap! <laughs> Damn crap! I think the other thing is that the little, uh... The dude that the heart is connected to, he will actively seek out enemies because normally he will take hits for you. Oh... So I think that might be part of it. I think. So he is actively being an idiot. Yeah. Good, I'm sure this challenge won't be infuriating. <laughs> <laughs> In all fairness, isn't there an item that would, like, Divine Wind would make you immediately win this, I'm pretty sure, a Breath of Life? Because it gives you invincibility at cost of damaging yourself, but it doesn't hit you if you have that, I think? Uh, maybe. Yeah, that almost does feel like you're playing as, like, a stand. <laughs> You're playing as a stand for somebody else. Um, let's try... Try pay to play. Let, let's try this. What? You start with 50 coins and every room is a... Or every door is a coin door. I don't know how I feel about this already. Hmm. Plus, you've got the money's power, so the more money you spend, mm -hmm. what you get. <laughs> but you also do have the coin purse, so. Yeah. Oh, and sometimes when you take damage, you also poop coins. Yeah, it seems like they give you items that make that help out, but this is still weird. But credit to them for making the new game modes more than just you get these items. Yeah. <laughs> Congrats, you start with this. I, I, I really like the idea behind that whole Guardian thing. Mm -hmm. Oh my gosh. This is just tricky because... And now I'm here. Okay, the map seems like it is worth the 15 coin sacrifice <laughs> to be able to always know the correct path. I feel like I will make up this investment quite quickly. Yep. Unless I am unfortunate enough that I just happened to... What? Okay, there's the button for the bigger map. Oh, but the map doesn't show boss rooms. That's right. So not as useful. Useful, not as useful. Also, I wonder if the any unlocks will actually work with the score thing. Well, on a better note, money is power is making my shots ridiculous already. Mm -hmm. Problem is, it rarely shows up when you need it in mm -hmm. an actual game. Also, I think this is new music, and I like it. Definitely improvement over the original soundtrack. Mm 
Not that the original was nearly as bad as people complained, but this one is better. The only part from Rebirth, the only music track I should say that I didn't really like was the original Depths music. I can't remember which that's one only, it was. I think that's it was because like, it had that uh, fucking microwave clock in the background constantly going beep, beep, beep. Yeah. And there was like one that I think that was just like, it just sounded really cheesy. I can't remember. It might have been the Shield redo or whatever. Is that the one with all the weird chanting? Is that the one you're thinking I think of? maybe. Yeah, that sounds right. Because I, I think I heard that one. I don't think that one got a new version. Or if it did, I haven't heard it yet. Oh, oops, well, I already spent it. Hmm, many enemies, they could drop many doubloons. Hmm, many champion enemies, they could drop many doubloons. Make that money. Give me the balloons. I thought champion enemies had guaranteed drops. Hmm. I don't think it was ever guaranteed, just really likely. Mm -hmm. Luckily, these turds are on point. <laughs> so, <laughs> thank goodness for these turds. Some primo turds. Mm hmm. Choice turds. Turd Deluxe. Turd Ferguson. Funny name. <laughs> Bigger than a regular hat. No usable items, though, so we're basically just running on this money is power, which, in all fairness, is pretty good. Yeah, challenges, I think, don't have treasure rooms unless. They show up as a secret, maybe? Mm-hmm. And, and, of course, the stuff you come across A one dollar but... devil room! Alright, yep, we're taking that. Give me that headless... Oh, no, that's not the one I was thinking. I was thinking of Dead Baby, the one that makes flies. Right. Oh, well. Oh, that's right. The red ones aren't champions. Um, okay. I'm fast, but I cannot fly. I need to pay attention. What is this, gish poop? Oh gosh, I'm in a corner. Gish poop. What? Yeah, it's gish poop. Oh. I don't think I've seen that. Yep, little gish poops. <laughs> That's in that pile of games that I'm like, oh, I should maybe play that sometime. And then I think about it and I'm like, mm, nah. <laughs> I played Gish for a little bit. It seemed okay, but it's, it's, it's still kind of a old. new grounds flash green in the end. So yeah. yeah. It's... Also, what are these yellow flies? I think they're pieces of corn. Is that is that the joke? Okay, I wasn't sure if they like. It's poop. I wasn't sure if they tracked in a way or something. They track, but like kind of like the haunt heads do. Hmm. Please give me doubloons. Bloody Penny. That seems like decent synergy. If I do actually get money.
Oh my gosh, okay. The Yeah, this challenge has a bit of slowdown to it in <laughs> in that you really want every coin you can get. Mm hmm Oh, so Retrovision just activates randomly now? That's good. <laughs> oh. Good, now I get the joy of figuring out which blood is mine and which blood is his. Luckily, I got hit and dropped coins, and then I dropped and picked up those coins, and they turned into hearts. There's, <coughs> there's that good-ass synergy. Fuck yeah, looping. <laughs> Oh my god, this heart health synergy is stupid! <laughs> it's working way too well! Hmm. I had to fight two of these guys at one point, it's not easy. Yeah, that retrovision thing is terrible! I hope that ends at floor. Is that a curse or just an item? It was a pill. Oh, uh, I see. Hmm. Wait, I got some curse that makes it so I can't tell how many hearts I have left. Oh, it's because I have soul hearts. I can't pick them up. I forgot that curse even existed because it's so lame. Yeah, the curses in general aren't really fun at all. I don't know why he still has them. Mm -hmm. What if we took away this basic piece of information? Well, I would be kind of upset, I guess. Like, I'd be like, like, really? Like, none of them are really challenging, it's just annoying. Mm -hmm. Oh my god, is that the chariot? Is that silver chariot? <laughs> the guardian. Hmm. Nice. <laughs> <laughs> Silver idiot. <laughs> oh my gosh, the only problem is I'm not getting coins as fast as I'm spending them. Even with the map. So eventually I'm just gonna run out of coins and I guess lose? Like, I don't... Hmm. There we go, thank god. You just declare bankruptcy. Yeah. I guess this challenge also just kind of has a fail state eventually. I'll have to take a bunch of hits and then pick up hearts to try and get more doubloons. Alright, good. I've hit the point where I can pick up hearts again. <laughs> Because I did get literally the best item. <laughs> no, bloody penny. That was the best item for this challenge, holy shit. It's almost to the point where I'm going to need to start getting hit on purpose.
Pill me up. Just, just fuck me up, Binding Isaac. Good. I love pills. They're great in this game. <laughs> hmm. This is starting to look more and more luck based. It's a little unfortunate because it was a neat concept. But I don't, they don't seem to give you enough shit to handle it unless you just, like, kind of get lucky and get enough coin. Yeah. I think they kind of gambled on you having enough coins from your penny bag there. But it's not but, guaranteed is the problem. Yeah. I was down to, like, ten, and I wasn't getting that many. The other problem is that it kind of slows down the more you go on. Yeah, because you start less having damage. less coin. Like, it would be fine if there was a way to make more coins back than you were. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I mean, that seems like one that, yeah, you could just, like, loop until you got Humbling Bundle and then be fine. 